Hey everybody, welcome back to Northern Land Place of Binding of Isaac. After birth, new run, keeping the streak going. South Beach bringing the heat, my aunt. Oh my god, it's a back half character again. Oh yeah, why not do a keeper run here? It's our fourth keeper run. Curse of the Blind, S6R8SXQM. Uh, I'm a little scared. I should leave those pennies. Uh, the Pinkin Shears, great item. Unfortunately, uh, not worth taking as the keeper because uh, the wooden nickel basically determines whether or not we live or die. <laughs> so we'll... Is there a tinted rock in here? No. Uh, I'm not thrilled about this, but this is... I, I actually like getting the keeper on the streak as long as we keep it going. Because I have, you know, every time the streak starts to get a little bigger, I get these comments, people go, Hey, NL, why... Oh, I didn't mean to open that. Why even do the streak? Like, you start playing so much less uh, adventurously. And I'm like, damn, dog. The first streak... Well, the, the long streak, I should say, we were uh, only doing Isaac Eden random after, like, win 20 or something like that. So, uh, I, you know, I'm, I'm playing adventurously is what I'm trying to say, basically by keeping the random on at all times here. And I'm not even using, like, an external randomer to make sure I don't random the Lost or the Keeper. Like, I think those are playable characters that are just very, very tough, you know? this There's implicit adventure here in the... Uh, in the fact that we can get the keeper, if you want it to be, if you want me to be zanier than playing as a character who's basically like on a suicide mission, I don't know what to tell you. I mean, I, I do appreciate the feedback, even though it sounds like I'm sarcastically rebuking it, um, and I'll, I'll keep it in mind. But good God, just just playing as the keeper itself is uh, it's zaniness enough. I feel. Okay, so we're on our own here. On the bright side, we do have two flies. Two flies don't bother me. And there we are. Just get through the haunt, and then we can panic. <laughs> if, you just, if you just kill this dude, we got nothing to worry about. This is like your nightmare scenario as the keeper. You don't want to be fighting this guy on the first floor without any, um, any upgrades having come your way, and, you know, without any... Coins that are available to you on the fight, but uh, it looks like we're probably going to be A-OK -okay here. And that's actually really encouraging. That's a really good start. So let's pick up whatever this is. It's PJs, so we just get some flies, and maybe uh, PJs might give us a, a tear up? A tears up? No, 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 come back! Ah, I really thought we could push it down into that other pot down there. There's a little bit of money I left behind, which is just what I'm thinking here. You know, why rush on a keeper run? Getting to boss rush could be worth something, but it's not at the end of the world if we uh, if we don't. Uh, we may or may not give a shit about deals with the devil, but we do give a shit about item rooms. Unfortunately, there's no key available in here, so I think we just buy this high priestess. I'm actually very happy to have high priestess. The shop is pretty valuable for us uh, from the perspective of being able to buy like a nine volt or something like that, or a triple A bat. Well, a triple A battery doesn't do. Too much, maybe, but a nine volt helps us out a ton. A nun's habit helps us out a ton. Um, of course, something like swallowed penny. We we can't afford to take shoop to whoop. So, like, just purge that from your mind right now. As much as I would love to take shoop to whoop because it's a great item, it it would kill us. It would it, it would directly result in our death. Well, I guess indirectly result in our death, but. The decision to take it would directly result in our death. We probably cost ourselves a chance at a deal with the devil. Brings me to like point two of playing as the keeper all the fucking time. You can't afford to panic, basically. So just, you know, be cool. Shit happens. I'm not super stoked about the fact that we won't at least have the option to see a deal with the devil. Like, I find that very unfortunate. But uh, I'm, I'm content with our situation regardless because in all likelihood we wouldn't have been able to take the deal with the devil anyway. So you just keep doing what you're doing, you know... The, the Keeper is very much, I, I think, like a... Not not to make things sound too exciting, but the Keeper is very much like a resource management character, I find, more than anybody else in Isaac. You know, it's about maintaining, for lack of a better word, part of it is about this anyway, uh, for lack of a better word, maintaining a good board state. You know, you want to keep HP available, uh, and then when that HP... We can go to our shop for free, right, because of the shop key. Uh, when that HP is necessary... That's when you uh, take the opportunity to get it. That's why I'm leaving a couple coins behind here. I actually think... Oh, that was a little dangerous. I think I'm building a pretty good portfolio of keeper play here. Even if we lose on this run, you know, we, we can feel very happy about the way our performance has gone uh, in the past. So that is a, like, doubtless take. 100% we take that nickel. 
leave the pennies uh, for HP. Although the, the nickel doesn't get used up if you pick it up. We shouldn't have picked it up yet because we don't. We just get four cents instead of five. So I did kind of botch it there, but I also just got distracted by dodging here. But that's something we probably shouldn't make a habit of. Good job, team. Hermit. More, uh, more of a teleport card, really, than anything else. Let's go find our item room, and then we'll try to get into our shop. Take one of these. 15 cents. Again, Swallowed Penny. I'm reminding myself as much as I'm reminding you. You know, Swallowed Penny. Nun's Habit, 9 Volt. Well, 9 Volt, yeah, 9 Volt would make it charge up on a room. So it would be worth it. Good stuff. Good stuff, team. Hourglass. No point getting bent out of shape about it. You gotta keep a good mental state. Hourglass is not an item we can afford to use here. It is, it's just not good. For us, that is. Let's throw a bomb down. Got more bombs. There's a tinted rock exclusively looking for small rock. We got uh, a bomb and some flies. Maybe it'll help us kill the boss, but you know, with High Priestess, the boss is probably fucked, regardless. Be ready to go. Yeah, we'll take, uh, we'll take deep pockets. We can carry more stuff now. Is it a huge pickup for us? Um, why was one of these things going in reverse? Can we talk about that? That's not the way that that's supposed to work. As if it isn't hard enough here. You know what? We save High Priestess. I wanted to take... Ooh, that was very dangerous. I wanted to take, uh, the Hermit so we can actually make use of both cards, but Pin... Now, putting too fine a point on it, isn't worth using the, uh, the High Priestess card. Krampus is, though. Uh, so, Guppy's Collar is, is just a fool's gambit here. Without an HP upgrade to take, we're just, we're getting out of here. As Precedent doesn't matter as much as, uh, as you might think at this point. So, unfortunately, we're going to get the heck out of here. And it is unfortunate. I wish that had been a better situation, but there we go. We're still alive as the Keeper, and being alive as the Keeper is really the big thing. What have we earned on this run so far? I'm glad you asked. We got a range upgrade and, and deep pockets, basically. Could be better, to put it politely. Should have used a coin there. That's okay. Or should have used the wooden nickel there, I should say. But uh, Again, any any run where you're still alive as the Keeper, is, it's the only thing that matters. You know, there's, there's no hidden objective here to... Like, ball out of control and, and just destroy this run. If we could, it would be awesome, but, you know, it's not really within the bounds of our control. What is within the bounds of our control is dodging. I know, exciting. Thought we were going to get hit there, actually. Good stuff. Wow, that was a great triple shot. Can't open it, unfortunately. May come back to bite us in the ass. It is really nice when you actually get a uh, a wooden nickel charge that works on a room that is slightly dangerous, you know? Just gives you a little bit of peace of mind. Unfortunately, we that peace of mind was absent there, but... It's okay, we'll slowly but surely make our way in the world today. Takes everything you got. Well, having a place to quell your worries sure would help a lot. I don't really remember the Cheers theme song. I was a little young for Cheers. I mean, it aired when I was like negative four. But wouldn't it be nice to get away? Uh, we should go uh, to that shop. Wow, lucky us. And we didn't have a charge there, so that would have scared me shitless. Again, I think it's you got to keep your cool here. You know, you got to be uh, you got to be relatively smart. And and level like you gotta handle your your mental state, keep yourself cool. Inside of our shop, we can buy a key, and I'm not buying any of those active items, so I think we should buy a key. That way, we can easily get to our shop, which contains our third consecutive space bar item, and this one's actually bad as well, which is even more disappointing. I yeah yeah It's okay. It's okay. Not not losing hope. We've been in runs like this before as the keeper. You know, it's 
A little bit of a slog, but you can make it happen. I think that's our secret room, unfortunately, because I would really like it to be adjacent to our curse room, but... I'll tell you what, we can check. It would be nice to pick up some extra cash. Maybe we could get a... Maybe we could get a uh, space bar item on the next floor. Not space bar item, sorry, a shop item. Hopefully, if we do get a shop item, it's actually not a space bar item. Uh, whole fucking run has been space bar items so far. Not that I'm, you know, pardon my French. Not that I'm too displeased about it or anything. You know, it's not like I wanted to win this run anyway. It's uh, pretty much a foregone conclusion that Keeper's like the easiest character in the game to win as. So, you know, who cares, right? Uh, that's good. That's a lot of money. Takes us to 14 cents with a 15th, uh, like, waiting back there. You know what? I do think we actually come back and uh, open up this golden chest back here. I think we leave this penny in the hopes that... Well, first off, let's hope we don't get hit. But if we do get hit, and that penny is back there, at least we don't have to walk through a room with spikes to get it. We might as well, like, not even give ourselves the chance to die that way. So, Fate's Reward is not the best payout. I would have preferred, like, a goat head, maybe. But this is one of the reasons, you know, it, I, I thought maybe from our... Uh, from our chest, we had a good chance to get a space bar item, so... Or at least a chance to get a space bar item, or a key, which would pay for itself. So, I figured we'd go for it, and there we go. We went for it, we got Fate's Reward. It's okay. Again, um... Compared to Pin, champion level Gertie is like a, a fucking nightmare, but... Uh, we, we can do this without using High Priestess. And again, you know, we gotta maintain this board state. Which is my way of saying it would be ideal if uh, we saved this High Priestess card maybe for like a Mask of Infamy or something like that. And this is the Gertie that doesn't even shoot at us, so... In a way, it's easier. In, in some ways, it's more difficult. It's gonna be a tanky enemy. It's also pretty much putting the, the Kibosh on uh, Boss Rush here. That's life. You know, you can't... Uh, you can't force, you know, your archetype here. If I want to get in and steal an item from Boss Rush, we need to have the damage necessary to, you know, be able to motor. And we're not motoring in anywhere here. We're, we're out for a Sunday drive on our way to the Country Kitchen Buffet. Nice, nice leisurely, you know, jaunt, basically. Okay. Range plus luck. The luck up may be actually pretty valuable. The range less likely to be. I'm going. Yeah, of course I'm coming back for this freaking penny. Are you kidding me? You never know, dog. I can't believe that this is what this is like our third keeper run in the last last seven or eight. The random is broken. I know it's not probably, and I'm just a victim of variance right now, or maybe uh maybe I'm I owe a debt to variance for. Helping me look like a better player than I am, but... Hey! That was the best dodge I've ever made in my life. Uh, and it was right after I stupidly used a wooden nickel for no reason on the last floor, and... Almost... Hey, well, let's put it this way, I got myself into that mess in the first place, didn't I? Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, pick up that nickel. Oh, well, let me tell you what, we'll pick that up for a second. And then we'll put the store key back down. I was really, quite frankly, expecting to get a penny there because we didn't get one last time, and that's that's the danger. We really shouldn't be expecting that. We that's not how math works. I should have left the nickel behind as well. That sucks, man. Not letting this tiny greed head end my run. Okay. You know, this, this is a really nice wake-up call to, like, play smarter. Oh, he almost got to me. And by play smarter, I'm, I'm talking again about maintaining that board state, dog. It matters. One of these days is going to have to pay out. I'm just saying it. Gemini. It's okay. Like, we struck out on variants a couple times here, and that's that's life, dog. That's gonna happen from time to time. Should go without saying, this room's fucked up. 
<laughs> we lived. Uh, how many streaks do you think this room's ended worldwide? More than its fair share, right? That's why I'm glad we could put it in its place, get back to full HP. We're not taking that pill under any circumstance. That could be a health down, it could be a bad trip, it could fuck our whole life up. Now, I, I do resist the notion that I got lucky to get a penny out of wooden nickel there. You know, odds are odds. We did strike out on wooden nickel like three times in a row just in advance of that, so... I feel like we've, we've done our part. <laughs> we, we, we paid the variance tax before we got our variance tax refund. Um, we will be able to go to our shop here. Slowly but surely goes the keeper run. Slowly but surely. And we save this High Priestess card. We save it for a better day. For a worse day. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. Every day for the rest of your life. I just remembered, I shouldn't be that nervous fighting the Keeper. Or I shouldn't be that nervous fighting Greed. When he hits us, he makes us drop HP. That's, that's pretty positive as far as, you know, asshole enemies go. Steam Sale, that's pretty useful. I'm, I'm for it. We should take that penny, maybe leave the other penny. You know what? Throw a bomb down here. Be a great time to get wooden, uh, sorry, to get Magic Mushroom. Then we could actually take that pill if we wanted to. Oh, we still here. We're grooving, baby. That was like a spirit heart or something. What do you think about this shit? We're not going to be able to get this, probably. That wasn't even close enough to, to, to get it either way. A couple of pennies. Aight. That didn't feel natural to say. I'll just admit it. Uh, flatworm. Definitely not worth it. The husk. For better or for worse. We continue to find great reasons to avoid using High Priestess. If we get hit, I'll, I'll use it in a heartbeat, man. Don't want to die against the husk. That'd be a little embarrassing. You know what would be dope here is getting an angel statue. Or an angel room. Would I even fight the angel statue? Almost certainly not. That seems like, uh, like a death wish. We got HP. Let's take the pill. Hilarious. Alright, well, I mean, we might as well take it. Head down to the next floor. This is the worst keeper run that is like still active. We're on the depths of one. We've gotten effectively nothing that improves our chances. Gemini? The steam sale? Like what what's our what's our win condition right now? I think it's a very valid question. Okay, we don't have a key, unfortunately. But we can get into our shop and buy one for three cents, should uh, should the key exist in the shop. I think it should, personally. Hey, thanks, Gemini. You're a real buddy. Cutting this Zambro up when I really don't have the opportunity. Chemical peel. Holy fuck, is this a, a misprint? Troll engine, you feeling okay? Because, uh... Oh, no! I didn't see it coming! Well, that is the end of the streak, for now. I guess we can get back to some zaniness. They finally got us on a damn dirty keeper run, but we tried, man. That room is, that room is tight. I even popped High Priestess, I saw the writing on the wall. Thanks for watching, uh, I'm a little salty that it ended like that, but hey man, that's what happens when you keep the, when you keep the keeper in. For now though, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. How's that a great deal? Of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future, but for now, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Gosh darn it. Back to, back to mediocrity.